that's why you don't even work on social that? media like that. Every time you somebody get... come, we got to fucking fuss, bro. Every fucking time. Every fucking time. You know what that's gonna, not what we're going to do. We're going to go back. I'm not we're going to commercial this. break. When we get back, we're going to wrap this up. So you want to you wanna cut me off, right? Corey, you just going to watch your butt. Just, you do this shit every time. Oh, yeah. Wait, 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 no, wait. That shit that I do when bitch was having a seizure, and that shit ain't go right. You, don't you know what I'm about? I thought she was about to do this. Go ahead. I'm the girl that I'm about to People with the cheap shirts and shit that shit that say melanin magic and all that, Popeye's not stopping your business. You are. Okay? So to you people that's using Popeye's excuse for your business, not to get a head, shame on you. <laughs> Nobody been Nobody been buying a melanin. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Welcome to Couch Talk Nola, you heard me? I am Queen Solo, this is South Park 504, oh, and we got oh, official. You heard me? Real Double rap. 017. You heard me? Real Stupid rap. Little bitch. Okay. You, you know me? why? That's yeah, all I'm I... saying. You heard me? Fuck it. This is episode official. It's, Let's just it's get official. <laughs> we officially in the right fucking there. building. You know so, how did you get started? Like, you don't push your button for your goddamn Don't mind it. Don't mind it. You push your button for your goddamn Don't mind it. Go ahead. Don't answer the question. Go ahead. How you got started? Don't they? He tell you he stole. How you got started? <laughs> I got started. I got started um battle rapping. That's how I started. Um, I was 19. I was like probably the youngest female battle rapping. And that's how I pretty much got started battle rapping and traveling and stuff. Did you like, start off battle rapping? Did you used to rap a lot? Is that that how it came no, about? No, no, cause battle rap not really just. What people think it is like ribbon. Cause it, it hurts when you get out there. Disrespectful. That's that is true. It that hurts. hurts what battle rap people think the you know the whole thing is. But the main thing about battle rap now is who is the better writer, who has mm -hmm. the better pen. Right. So it's more so about punchlines, metaphors, similes, double entendres, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Like you yeah. can't just go up there and. And joke like you. I'm not one of the rappers. Like you come up there, you talk about me, you talk about my this girl, and they big and all that. Girl. Yeah, the so be dying for that. Girl, yeah, you know, hey, I'm, I'm still, still trying to get up there, right? <laughs> so, like, they, I, you can't get up there and joke with me right. because my bars and my metaphors and my pen so fire, like it's gonna so, cancel yeah, out you, every joke you had. Yeah. I mean, you gotta do some a little bit of research yeah. before you get up there about the person. That's, you gotta know what the fuck going on. You. You, you you send people to grief counseling, that's all I'm saying. Cause uh, you, yeah, that's, yeah, that shit hurt. Yeah, cause yeah. see, jokes is <laughs> for the moment. Right, Once right, you right. hit a joke, that's the joke. It's over with. It's over yeah. with. You can't read But the that. bars, you go catch a bar every time. A new person, like, what is this yeah. thing? That's, that's why. I that's, like that crowd. How you be feeling, like, do the crowd energy be, like, fucking you up more? Cause it be like, in the oh, 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 shit. Yeah. Like, you know yes. what I'm saying? It definitely you gets sometimes. you. It gets you. Gets you more into it, but it also, like he said, it can mess you up sometimes. Like if the crowd ain't messing with you, ain't reacting. Like you just gotta be able to get through any type of crowd. And right. so you did that you buck you up more when they be bucked up with you, <laughs> and then they be silent when other people be like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> But that doesn't even matter. Like the crowd doesn't determine the battle. Mm -hmm. I've seen plenty of times in a building the other person had the crowd and he lost on camera. Oh shit! So yeah. it doesn't it doesn't really determine it. So, so you used to battle. So you used to battle like on in your neighborhood like before you no. officially got on camera. Oh. No, I didn't used to battle. It's crazy because um I used to. I, I'm, I'm inspired by Wayne. I love Lil Wayne. Mm -hmm. So I didn't really know how to do music, but I, I like punchlines. So I just used to write raps. But um, when I went to West Jeff, I probably was in the ninth grade. Mm -hmm. I had went to school, they was rapping. I was like, oh, I can rap too. And they had like a girl. The next day, everybody's like, oh, you was the girl that was rapping at lunch. Yeah. So the next day, another girl came up to me. She was like, I heard you rap. I rap too. Rap some. <laughs> like, rap some. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But this is before I was a battle rapper. Like, if you. It's still on camera if you see it. It's like I was battling her because I was freestyling because it was all at the top. But I was talking about her. Mm -hmm. And she was 
rapping back at me. And somebody posted it and they put um Jesse versus Cakes and I was in the ninth grade and that battle had got five hundred thousand views. Yeah, so it was to the point where I went to um I went to another city I had moved to and someone had said, Hey, you the girl that was on video rapping, I seen you rap which is crazy because that's how my life turned out to be when I didn't even plan on being a battle rapper of uh, yeah. Anything like that. Even how they set it up when they put it online, they put Jesse versus Case. It was not a mm -hmm. battle. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, so, like you really got the swag. So I was people. like, like I was going on? Yeah, so <laughs> So after that I had to um that was just me getting into rap. But when I graduated from high school, I was like I ran into some shit. I was like, man, let me try it. Let me see if I can battle rap. Like mm -hmm. and ever since then I've been fucking them up. Like it went from being in New Orleans, like trying to find a battle league, sending my shit all over, trying to get on in New York, everywhere else, to being like the number one battle rap. Did you used to live in New York or something? Like no. Oh. Oh. I go to New York a lot. Oh, you got, okay. yeah. Okay. You, I go to New York a lot. Like a whole lot. My fan base, like New York is probably 80% of my fan base. Oh. And. Yeah, son. No. Yeah, I love them. I love them. Yeah, I love them. Yeah. I love them. Right that's how they, that's how they feel about New Orleans. They come to New Orleans, they be like, I love New Orleans. I be like, well, I, I know I'm from New Orleans. I love right. New Orleans, of course, but I love New York. Like, the opportunity yeah. to love they show is just A lot like, of people okay. say they don't have a lot of... No, they have no Southern hospitality yeah. at, all. at all. But they are supportive <laughs> of, of, of rap. Right. Like they can have a it's show. All about, that's real rap. You got to write the real shit. They can have a show out there where nobody know who's performing and it be packed. Yeah, I like shit like that. Like yeah. they show. Come out. Like I have all together on YouTube. I think I have what it came out to six million views all together. All from a lot from New York, like I really. But see, New, they, New York fucking with you or anything up north fuck with you, you real because they ain't going, they ain't no yes man up there. They just let you know, nah, yeah. like boo. Well, they had no choice. I had to make them. I really had to make them because there wasn't nobody coming from the south. So I was like one of the first female, like first battle rappers, period, from the south to make it. They the definitely stage. made you an honorary New Yorker. <laughs> you got the so how you got the name official? You just, that just I named myself that. Yeah, but see how like it's like a New York, but they see New Orleans. Mm -hmm. That's what the world see. Like like right. y'all can tell. Yeah, like yeah, oh yeah. it's just, oh I see a little vibe like they see New Orleans. Like that's what right. I represent. That's what I rap. Like no, this is what we do in New Orleans. And I have like I see people here. They come up to me. Oh, I'm fish my fuck with you. I'm like, oh, I didn't even know y'all were fucking with it out here like, like that. Y'all yeah. <laughs> fucking with it like that out here? Oh, they like, yeah. Oh, they were very, and I'm alive. Everybody I met in New Orleans has been super supportive. They always say New Orleans not really supportive. I was about to say, I was going to get to that. But I guess for the fact that ain't nobody from the South doing it in battle rap, like, why? You know what I'm saying? Like, man, we women, fuck especially. Women ain't women. doing too much. Right, right, right. Yeah. right. They going to fuck with me. They happy. They happy. I must see everybody I meet in New Orleans be, like, just happy. I'm a, I'm a trickle on back down to Wayne because you you mentioned that Wayne was a big influence to you mm -hmm. you know as far as you get into the rap game. So what era of Wayne was it? What the Carter one, Carter two? What's going on? I gotta I have to ask that because I I'm more um, of a Carter two fan. Me. I'm person. from. I say dedication. Yeah, <laughs> I am definitely from dedication. Yeah. Like, I'm one of the females that can sit down and probably rap every Wayne song with you. Like, I've oh, been a Wayne oh. fan since when it was Lime Wire. I was downloading oh, all Wayne songs. Oh, you got song. the song. You yeah. got the like, trying to get that Listen, shit. I, listen, I, Wayne is the reason <laughs> I rap the way I rap. And he's bars. He's punches. Mm -hmm. He's a pen. His pen is ridiculous. Like, What's your favorite uh, Wayne? Uh, the Hot 16 for a Wayne. Who? What's, your, what's your favorite? Oh, yeah. Jesus, I, she just asked yeah. me to hit. Yeah, <laughs> I, 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 I want to know because I want to know your what, which one. Woo, my favorite. <laughs> Wait, who is your favorite? Wait, who is your favorite? Man, you going there? Oh, you know what I'm saying? That's kind of hard. You heard me? Okay, I think levels. Man, all these pussy niggas drive me crazy. Make yeah. me sick to my stomach. I feel nauseated. All you hating ass niggas could jump off a building. <laughs> I could still taste a pussy. Memorabilia, pack pack full of artillery. One me no equivalent. These niggas acting like little bitches. I don't understand these niggas like you scribbled it. Take a clothes off that back and exhibit it. 
and tears up like a pump ticket. The end of the road isn't walking distance. Had to get the blood off my hand, left the faucet dripping. In your face like an airbag in the car collision. <laughs> my weed man's so consistent. I'm staying rich, trying not to man put the scissors. Everything I do, I plan it out like a solar system. Nigga, if you clumsy, you go slip and fall a victim to me. Your bitch is some naked pictures to me. And she shoot over to my house. I shoot over to her bed. I scoot off in her mouth and she bit the bullet. Ugh. I, I swear to God, I swear, I felt like she oh, sent them to you. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just the fact that in that, he punched back to back. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. Back to back. I don't understand this shit like you scribbled it. Take her clothes off, step back, and exhibit it. Then tear her ass up like a pocket ticket. Yes. The end of the road is in walking distance. Had to get the blood on my hands. Like the boss is different. Like... Wayne yeah, punches. Yeah. He punched. That's why I punch. Nah, I punch nah, like that. Nah, like, that's how I rap. Like I it. punch back to back. You big on wordplay yourself. Yes, I'm huge uh, on wordplay. I love that Beretta battle. You play it off her name. Brilliantly. Yeah. <laughs> that, 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 that's it instantly. As soon as I hear a name, I think about how I can flip your name. <laughs> and everything. Said, and like, security couldn't carry it. Uh, couldn't carry the Beretta mall cops. When yeah. You said that shit. Like, <laughs> damn. That's yeah. crazy. I know I fucked up that the was line. Name. Yeah. Like, that's, that's how it's battle rap too. Like that's what I think about like name flips. You know what I'm saying? Like her name was Beretta. So mm -hmm. Beretta name flips. That concealed like, weapon line was. Oh, I love it. That and I love that. Listen, line. that was the one. Woo. Oh, the one I like. The one. Um, Scotty, you trying to make the day look better? You out here pampering the skeleton? You threw Beretta in that water, bitch. You tampering with whatever it is. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, nice cream line from that dog. Down. She just talking about the fucking ice cream line. Working, you hear? Yeah. yeah, that took me a while. That, now that took me something to put together. Yeah, I pull put up that at together. your window, Big Mac service. You heard? Come to pull up and serve it. Oh, yeah. and make it be. Yeah, Big Mac with mean service. Yeah, with mean service. Yeah. She didn't expect to see ice cream. cream. Then I showed her the machines working. Yeah. Oh, and she delivered. Oh, it's she's in the building. Oh, yeah, I hate to fucking have this fucking have to go to a break, but this is what oh, we gotta fuck. do. Shit. We got official subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Yeah, make sure you subscribe, you heard me. She House Talk Nola, episode official, stupid a bit. <laughs> Be right back. Double M, double M. Twitter, he tagged you and a couple of other battle rappers and said DM him. I'm like, what? Like, drop him out of here. I'm lying. Yeah. So I went to Twitter and he was, and I gave my number, and I remember I was at work, and he called me, and I was like, oh shit, dude, this is really Snoop. <laughs> so I was chilling, I was chilling, I was like, what's up? What's up? What's up? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, you got it. <laughs> so he was just telling me how he was a fan, 
-hmm. and how he um started watching. He said he watched me because um he watched the Daylight Battle. When I battled Daylight, I was like, oh, oh okay. <laughs> so he was like, yeah, I'm a big fan of you. I'm trying to do an event for the BT Awards weekend, and that's when he did the event. Mm -hmm. And um when we went out there, it was a bunch of other battle rappers because it was a whole event, and. It was great. Bishop Don Juan was in the motherfucker. Oh my Damn, we everywhere we was <laughs> just pick up the weed and roll the shit. Like, yeah. But he, like I said, it was a bunch of other battle raps. So he was just giving time to everybody. You know, so plan to kill or whatever. So when it's time for the battle, I smoked the bitch. Yes. You heard me? Because they had Nelly on stage and yes. shit. I'm Ooh, like, not playing. Ooh. So um, he called me like two weeks later. Uh, like a yeah, like no, he called me like a week later. He was like, Yo, fishing, you killed shit. It was amazing. He was like, I want to fly you out to Cali to do this green screen. Mm -hmm. So that's he was trying to do something where when you battle on a green screen, he had a shit come out the floor. Like, so if you was like mm -hmm. skeletons drop, a skeleton really will pop up on us, mm -hmm. you know, it oh, drop. Okay, like, he was fire. He had yeah. a great vision with that shit <laughs> fire. So, um, he was like, Yeah, I need you to come out in two weeks and do it. I'm like, Nah, oh, you know, <laughs> you ain't into battle rap like that, but um, right. it take a little more than two weeks to battle, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but he was like, oh, but I'm like, for you, anything's possible. <laughs> so he flew me out there, and um, when I went there, I didn't even know I had a GG in that record. I didn't even know what it was. Honestly. Right, right, right. So he came in, he was like, oh, yeah, he was like, you're the only one here, so now it's just me and him one on one. He was like, yeah, you don't know what hit Shayna Ashley couldn't make it. He was like, but we still can record your side. He was like, but I, you're going to do a GG and Eric interview. I'm like, okay, what that is? Mind you, I'm in Cali, so I'm already high as shit off Cali. Right. And the motherfucker Snoopy yeah. came in, yeah. gave me a blunt, I'm That's high. Shit, so dude. when my um producer, he pulled it up, he like, yeah, he about to interview you. I'm like, wait, no, like this time I wanted to be prepared for right, it. Right, 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 right. You know, get it together. But when I went up there, I just pretty much was like, just be myself. Yeah, that's all you can be with him anyway. That's yeah. all I was. But I seen a guy before me, and he he did he didn't do too well. He was very. He just, I just knew looking at him not to do that. Right. So I, knew, <laughs> he I showed know, you everything you wasn't supposed yeah. to. Do. That's a fact. So I'm like, okay, just gonna be myself. And um, he just loved New Orleans already because yeah. of Master P. And he, he used to live there. He used to stay out there. And yeah, 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 yeah. He loves it. And we just got a connection. And ever since the GJ and Network interview, he's like. Been fucking with me heavy. He come to New Orleans. He done shouted me out on the radio. He done yeah. put me on the list. Like he be sharing my shit on his page. All he be asking. Like he was the supporter. He was sitting at like Nipsey was on the GG. <laughs> yeah, I realized exactly yeah, what I was when I was sitting like, next to Snoop. I realized yeah. what I was. But still, it's he met plenty of battle rappers after. You right, know, right, and, right. But I'm one of the ones who who got a bond with him. Like he right. really. Like, I can inbox them, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, what's good, you know, like, and that's just good, just pretty much be yourself, and like people say, like, people always love people from New Orleans, from the South, like, right. how can you not love nobody yeah, from the like, we, 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 we really like, yeah, yeah that they should love them. you know, you, damn, you, you, you are definitely a part of history, I hope you understand that. <laughs> And you yeah, you are. You are, you are paving the way. We don't have a lot of women doing anything right now, right. especially in the battle rap field. Mm -hmm. And that Definitely shit ain't easy like, getting up there and battling. You and I battle niggas. You got that's what I'm saying. I was about to ask you, what differentiates your battles from the women and the men? Like, how do you feel? Like, what differentiates that? Nothing. And I think that's why I stood out. Because I always treated the women like the niggas. Ooh, okay. I started off battling No niggas. breaks. Yeah, I started off battling niggas, so I just ran through the women. Mm. So, like, now I, yeah, I stand yeah. in front of niggas, and I stood in front of, like, a, like Disaster. He's, like, one of the greatest. Yeah. He battled Cassidy. Mm -hmm. He's the most viewed, like, he's, you know what I'm saying, amazing. Stood in front of Run Nitty recently. He's the best punchline rapper out of the guys, period, right now. And you right. Had, period. you had 33 battles so far? Yeah. That's a lot of I had to have a lot because I came from the south. Like them right. girls up north, they only had a few battles because they was already up there. I really had to fucking really hustle and grind it out. Beat these Get bitches. Out the mud. Right. Yeah. I really did. Yeah, I really oh, did. So how do you feel about battle rappers and coming to be an artist or a rapper? Because it's two different you can't it's two different fields. So yeah. how do you feel about that? I tell people who hear my music today because they love it. They're like, yo, you sound like 
it wasn't this easy. I would tell anybody, like, people be like, yo, I admire what you do as a battle rapper. I'm like, yo, I, I admire what you do as an artist. Mm -hmm. To be able to go into a booth and not think so much, because I think about everything I write. Mm -hmm. Y'all rap what y'all feel. You know what right. I'm saying? But it really took me, like, four years to transition. Mind you, I have no music out, but I have over 100 songs. I right. felt like I needed so to... Sitting on shit. Unreleased? Unreleased? They're never going to release. Because that was practice. Oh, okay. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was battle rapping. I needed to, like, when I started doing music, I was I was thinking too deep. I was too intricate. Everything was a punchline. Everything was a bar. I really had to dumb my mind down to stop I'm, I'm thinking. sorry, you said intricate? Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, you went to yeah. college. <laughs> I went to college with battle rap. I'm <laughs> but, um, you really into your artistry. You yeah, know. like, the, the shit, like, was just too intricate everything was a punchline a metaphor or something i was like that's not what music is music is content so i had to learn how to stop <laughs> thinking so deep into things which kind of fucked up my battle rapping because now when right. it was time for me to go to you battle rapping think, think, think I'm like, it's harder to come up with the shit when it was easier so it really took me years to balance it to now i could go record a song the same day and do a battle the same day you won't know it's from the same artist it's like, a lot of like, like yeah, it took me a while. You see that. how a lot of battle um artists, especially like Cassidy, as you mentioned earlier. Cassidy, I feel like he should have he could have been further, but it's a different feel. You know what I'm oh, saying? It's two mm -hmm. different feels, two different lanes. Totally different people today. say that battle rappers can't make music. I say I tell people this in a minute. They be like, Your battle raps can't make music. I say because ninety eight percent of battle rappers are from up north. Yeah. I'm from the South. Right. We know how to rap. We right. know how to ride yeah. beats. We know how to. Only thing is, I have an up north. And I won't even say it's an up north pen. That's East Paul. I would say it's an up north pen because. <laughs> I would say it's an up north pen because I would tell people in a minute, they'd be like, who you came up listening to? Like I tell my uncle all the time, like, what? How you don't know these? He was like, you. I said, I've never. I, I didn't come up listening to Jay Z. I didn't come up listening to Nas. But if you listen to my pen, people would think, think those are did. I'm like, no, I came up listening to Wayne, yeah, Soldier yeah. Slim, like Hot Boys. Like, that's what I really came Fresh. up listening to. But Wayne was a nigga that was intricate like them up north. Mm -hmm. He just knew how to ride a beat and rap and flow and do shit. So I always tell him, like, y'all say, they say battle rappers can't make music. Because they're all from up north and they don't know how to ride beats. <laughs> Facts. Put a beat on. Yeah, but a lot of them like that. <laughs> they going to try to battle the beat. I had to, you know, I don't battle the beat, I ride the beat, like, right, right. I just know how to say shit while I ride it. It took a while for Meek Mills to even get in the game, because remember, he, he was like, fuck, I was a battle rapper, I didn't know how to, I didn't know how to make a hit song, you know what I'm saying, right. it took him a while. So I, I do believe it's possible, it's just going to take a while, it's right. not going to be overnight or anything. Right, and I didn't want to just put it out, because... Right. Anybody can see me at any moment. Like, I have a, a fan base. I don't know who can see. I don't want people to be used to okay music. Because if I'd have put that music out, they'd have been like, and I'm like, okay, now I'm ready. Check this shit out. They'd be like, well, we heard you. Yeah, it was yeah, all right. Was okay. Now, no. Now when you hear me, it's, yo, she's fine. Like, automatic. Like, I didn't need them to see me grow. Like, I needed to grow behind the scenes. And speaking of growth, like, from when you battled Boogie, all the way up until your last battle, mm -hmm. that's tremendous growth, and you was like raw then. You hear me? Yeah. So I'm like, how the hell could she even get better when she was already fucking killing it? The shit that you get up there and, and say it just be like it's too easy, like it come out so smooth. You just be like relaxed. You're not overthinking it. You mm -hmm. already got it. Mm -hmm. uh, as far as other, the other people that you battle, they just be sitting there like trying it. You can yeah. see. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They wear their emotions on their sleeve, by the way. So. Right. But yeah. it's like we don't know how to do that. Yeah, do that. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. That's why my demeanor uh -huh. too is why people be like, oh, she can battle niggas. Yeah, because I'm like, we would all smoke in New Orleans. You know how we use the girls in New Orleans? We don't yeah, play. Like, we are really be nigga ass. Like, like, what? <laughs> 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 in a minute, and they don't, don't even think about the fact that you about to hit me after and still sneak your ass. Like, and, and that's like, how you got to battle these niggas. Like, I don't give a fuck what you about to say to me, nigga. Yeah. I'm about to say it's it. going to you for, right. right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got to really be A lot honest. of women can't stand up there you know, in front of niggas. You know, because yeah. niggas be saying all kind of underhanded. I stand in front of any nigga. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. But any you, nigga. But you know I don't what? care. I like battling niggas. I wish. 
Uh, wish we could battle this fucking time. We gonna take a brief intermission. Take one. We gotta come yeah, back on my time. You heard me? We gonna get into some more shit. You heard me? Call us talk no love. You heard me? The official subscribe. episode. Double O. You did? Double M. Make sure y'all fucking subscribe. I ain't playing with y'all. Trying to get to the U We going to the YouTube camp. Yeah. Trying to play. Yeah. And it was like, Jazz is here. We made sure nothing happened to you. All I seen in your ass was fear, but you made it back to New York safe. Not a gas is here, so basically New Orleans is the only reason that jazz is here. It's <laughs> Damn, this cat, this cat don't talk when rats around. Tom and Jerry, text me, my dude watching. I got the proctor ready, cock the desi, jazz. You can stop already, pop a gun. You too afraid to even pop your cherry, but... <laughs> but let me catch your boys in the hood, and they gonna get the Tommy. And Jazz, you gonna get the 12 gauge like Ricky, try me, or end up in the wheelchair like Lil Chris. You can pick the body. I'm basically asking you what treatment you want. Ricky, bake on Ricky, Bobby. <laughs> And we back, you heard me? We told you we were going to be back. Subscribe. Yeah, make sure y'all subscribe. Right. Um, so, official, what do you have coming up? What you got coming? You going to go on tour? You do anything? I got my music coming up. It's great. Like, it's amazing. I've been working with Casey, the producer. He oh, of course. Yes. Amazing. And I'm just happy because I've been killing it every time we go to the studio. I fuck with Casey. Um, What's up, KC boy? Yeah, just <laughs> we were, it's, it's, this is my year. Like I, I felt like now it's time. Like I just did everything I could do doing battle rap. I done reached. Let's let's be the clear here. Top. I just did everything out the way. You didn't you had a couple years. Yeah. Fuck, what the fuck you mean, Miss Yo? Yeah, you done had a few years. No, this is my year for music. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, okay. no, this is my year for music. Okay, okay. Like battle rap. Like the, I'm just saying, like battle rap. I've done it all. So you like, gonna take a break on that or? It's not really a break. Mm -hmm. I'll still battle, but it's I'm, I literally battle all females. It's a little sabbatical, you know. Like it, it's uh -oh. really just not my going to be my main focus. It's music now. I didn't battle. I didn't reach the the the, the platform. Mm -hmm. Battled everybody. The did reach, everything. The reach right. Intricate levels. Right. It, and I feel like it prepared me for the next level. Like that's why I'm ready to do interviews. I'm, mm -hmm. I know how to stand in front of a crowd, in front of people that right. not fucking with you. Fuck with you. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? Like. I just know the things to do and to prepare me for the future in my music career. So of course. that's what it's about now, my music. Like, and I feel like y'all gonna love it. Like, I, I can't wait. Music. I can't wait. When is that planning it's on? It's time. Well, it's so past time. This year, it's time for a female. Like, I'm telling you, I'm gonna be the hardest female to stop. Twenty twenty is the year of female. Good. That's right. Twenty twenty official. What are you, what are you um, planning on dropping this album? Cause I mean, this year. I know when you all got a no date, no date. Damn, I tried to help y'all out. I tried. I said a date because when ain't the date, girl, you said yeah. the date yeah. was. Yeah. Oh, uh, people do that. Yeah. Did I say April? Oh my bad. Uh, then you gotta get him the duck ass award for how many? Yes. No, um, same. I have like I have a already have a celebrity feature. Oh, okay. 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 I'm so excited oh, about that. So just I'm just happy. I'm just excited and like just showing it and my music. I, I do it for, the, of course, the, the females. The females yes. will love me because I'm need, hard. We need, we need. But I feel yeah. like guys for real rap and real music, I feel like men don't have a female they can literally, like they can listen to and they will. They can't be in a whip with they niggas playing Cardi B mm -hmm. and Nicki Minaj. Be careful with her. I mean, they can just kind of play Remy Ma back in the day, yeah. Yeah, but, but Remy is a hard yeah, rapper. She's so more hard. of the, yeah. feet. like that's down the, you know what I'm saying? What I'm saying, but I'm just saying, like as of now, like just it's been a long time since mm -hmm. they can't listen. They don't want to listen to that pussy bopping nah, all the time. Nah, nah, I see what you're right? saying. Right, like yeah. I can't ride with that to know. I want it to be like, man, y'all know that new official drop, son? Like, yeah. So, That's so, so with saying. you, you creating this lane in your own. Like, right. do you feel like females have it really hard? Like, we have to be sexist and all this. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it feel like. A lot of rappers that could be, or female um, artists that could be, 
big and you know successful they don't because of the the image they not they don't you know what i'm saying opposed to back in the g when missy and you know the brat came out <laughs> they didn't show their bodies off like that because they can't rap i realized that men respect rap like if a female can rap they don't give a shit what she look like real rap bro. they're really going to be like oh she hard mm -hmm. While if the female in the industry, these females can't rap. Mm -hmm. So they have to look good. Somebody, they have to show their body. They have to do sex appeal. <laughs> they can't be standing there in a the jacket like me, just up there rapping that, that ratchet shit. You know, like, this bitch trash. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, but, but like, I realize men respect. So I, I, I don't want to say, like, yo, guys have it hard on their feet. Because when I walk in the building, they respect. Right, you're mm -hmm. not a I never say I, they show me they show me love, they bow down, they might even tell these niggas like she she a fuck you up. Like, yeah, like you know what I'm saying? And I like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, plan. So what would be your top five female artists? Hmm. The unsigned. Oh, that's what I'm saying. What you doing? That you guys unsigned. Yeah. Top female artists? You mean like in a city or Worldwide. Worldwide? Mm -hmm. That's a hard question, baby, because I've been like, oh, <laughs> no. Oh, you know, top dude. five raw talented females. You know, what I mean? you, you know some people out here underground, right? No. Okay, let me do a try. Because <laughs> like, we really don't have a lot of females, that's why it's. Because I'm also, I'm a hard critic. You're right. I respect rap too, so. Mm -hmm. I'd be right there with niggas like, bitch, let me try. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And then that sex appeal shit don't go nothing for me. Oh, but that's what they so try to use. So. It don't, I'm really standing up there judging you by what's coming out your mouth. Like, I don't, as a female, yeah, I don't care what you look, look like. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But, yeah. um, I like Brookie. Yes. Brookie. Amazing. Brookie, yes. Yeah, I was always like, waiting on Bricky to come. See, look, me and Bricky go get together. We go rap. It has to happen. Yeah, we already talked about. It. We been supposed to do it, but we she she fuck with me. I fuck with her. She's always been supportive. I support her. We go rap. She the truth. When I tell she you, she a rap. Um, Lady Dally. Okay. I love her. Her grind is unmatched, bruh. Very consistent. I've never seen nobody grind like her. Consistency, bruh. Mm -hmm. You were also on her. Um, Cypher. Yes, that, yes. And she's about unity. Like, she's about unity. So, like, you gotta love that. She rap, real rap. She looks good. She not out there trying to look good and rap that other shit. No, she's yeah. up there rapping yeah, while looking shit. good. Mm -hmm. She not don't she not trying to make her look push her in the door. Right. You know what I'm saying? Um That's it. Yeah, you know oh, um well no, I can't say how you say I'm sorry, I was gonna say of course, 3D. Yeah, of course, me. Mia. But I don't. I don't really. I ain't gonna lie. I don't really. I don't, listen. I don't want to be up here because. <laughs> <laughs> listen. I don't want to be up here because be like, yo, she not with the females. Females right, yeah, together. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I love my females. I, I'm not gonna ever try to like. If it's any time, it's time to support. I'm gonna be standing there supporting you. Want you to go through the door. Want you to go higher and everything. You call it how you see. As a fan, though, I'm a fan of rap. Yeah. I, I fuck a rapper, so a lot of this shit that a lot of females be spending, I don't be want to hit none of that shit. It's Cause it sound like the same shit all over and over again. To be quite honest, you only got a very select few that's really it's not music. That, that rap. It's not you music. Know what I'm yeah. So I just had to ask you, you know, and you did say you wasn't going with the females. You don't want to be okay. Well, cool. So if you had to, you if you it. was drowning in the water, oh lord, and Bricky. And Lady Dahlia lyrics was to save you. Who lyrics? No Brickies. Yeah, yeah. Bricky is clearly the better rapper. It's not a lot of feet. There's not a lot of niggas that can rap with Bricky. And that's not even a show. That's, that's why I have had a lot of the collaboration. The collaboration with you and her is gonna be nasty. Yeah, yeah. Not a lot of niggas that can rap with Bricky. That's yeah. But Lady Dahlia is an artist. Yeah, that's, that's, the, that's what people need to understand. Yeah, it's a difference. It's a, a different record. difference. Like, so, you know, an artist and a rap. That's what people be trying to put artist. in the same cat. It's not. If it's like time to say, yo, who go, who you go get to go smoke this nigga? I'm getting bricky. Right. Yeah. Be like, who you trying to get to sell out and have a good show? I'm going with Dahlia. You know what I'm saying? It's just whatever you mm -hmm. want to put it at. But that fucking mm -hmm. hustle is but crazy, I, though. I'm going to want to see Lady Dahlia also go across the stage while bricky. You can stand there and just rap. Like, right. You, know you ain't got to move. Like, just stand up. Just stand up. Just rap. Yeah. <laughs> just rap. Yeah. 
different artists. It's just two different, yeah. It's just two different different ladies. Yeah. But um, let's talk about this 0017. How did this all come about? Oh, man. (laughs) The journey, huh? Yes, the um, ANRST. He um, actually happens to be a family member of mine. Wow. So he actually been doing music and everything. And I was doing battle rap. And I went to him like, hey, I do music now. Let me let you in. Because I went ready. I know when to go to people when you're ready. Close right. mouth. And then you wait till you're ready. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, and I did. I sat down with him. I let, let him hear my music. He was like, he loved it. And ever since then, history. Great music. Great yes. music. Yeah, he right. has a great team. He put together me, um, another artist, artist named Davo, another artist there named is. King Ego. Like, we the hardest in the city. Like, yeah, really? not, ain't nobody rapping. Ain't no female rapping with me. Ain't no nigga rapping with King Yo. Ain't no fucking niggas making hits like Davo. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, ST put together a great team. He's a, he's amazing. Mind Double O. They hold everything. They all have great minds, mm-hmm. and they know what to do. Right. And I'm here to do it. Y'all are real brand new, <laughs> for real. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, Double yeah. 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 O Seventeen Machine. Yeah. Are you gonna plan on having your own merch coming out? Yes, I have official merch. I had um, my soul shirts. I had the official shit, but this year I'm doing everything. Yes. Everything. Putting my my website. Everything. Everything will be up this now, year. Now before. It's all said and done. What impact that you would have liked to make in the industry? You heard me? Um, respect it. If I could have a 3D dot T career, which I'm not saying her career is right. bad or anything, but we know she hasn't signed to any major labels or she hasn't been mainstream. She's definitely but all she's about independence. Respected. Mm-hmm. Right. If I could be respected around just in hip hop. Mm-hmm. And be known like official that that's enough for me. You know what I'm saying? Like it's not about oh I wanna be the Cardi B and sell out the million, uh, yeah. but my bars, people don't know if I write it or not. It's I, I'm really a hip hop and I'm really about rapping, so yeah. I just wanna be respected. Yeah. And that's how I did it with, 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 with battle rap. Like I made myself respected. So yeah. I'm fucking yeah, I, 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 can't I can't wait. I can't wait for them the album to drop. I can't wait for the merch to pop. I know it's Joe Yu. You gotta see about that duck ass. She thought she was gonna shimmy on out here. You, you, you gotta give it to whoever you do some duck ass shit. <laughs> the guy you like. Um, duck ass award goes to. Ooh, what's the lady that got fired for saying the, on the, Fox? The 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 Los Angeles Knickers? Yeah, oh, the Knickers. The Knickers, was that, the Knickers was that bitch. Fox or was that NBC? Who was that? Duck ass award for that was, bitch. Whoever she was. Who said nigga and thought we ain't noticed? That and she got fired. Done. Let's be clear. <laughs> but this has been the episode official. Double O Seventeen, stupid little bitch. Double M one What's up? I am here. Queen Solo. This is South Park Five Hundred Four. Thank y'all for tuning in on our live. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Another dope episode. Oh, yeah. me. Official real rap. Yeah. Uh, oh, shout out to T. They heard me. Hey, T. I love yeah. her. She's the best. <laughs> yeah, we out. Damn, I'm so Never been afraid to call a bitch right Been a real bitch all of my life Pouring some purple all in my sprite Pretty bad bitches all of us fight Yo, we so evil Rock bands like the Beatles Death row bars lethal Transparent, y'all see through My life be a movie Really a movie, y'all looking at the previews We was raised different Came out of the cave, gifted For they made Christmas Judge a book by its cover But don't even notice the page missing Look in my eyes, you can see the real Look in my closet, you see the kiss Like the homeless, I need a meal I'm not sick, but I need a bill I got the juice, so I keep it still Play my cards, gotta get a deal Risk game so cold Whenever I tell the time, I get the chills Put some respect on my name Y'all disrespecting the game Said he neglecting my fame So I'm projecting the pain Don't give a fuck about none of the extra you bring Bow down when you see the queen Kill a bitch and lead a scene Witnesses ain't see a thing Do you dirty, but I keep it clean Martin Luther, I see the dream Steady plot and I see the schemes All stars on the court, of course All these niggas won't be the team I am the queen, I am the queen, I am the queen.